All right, tis the season to give back, and this year, Toys for Joy expected to bring lots of smiles to lots of San Diego families. The goal is pretty good. It's 23,000 toys, 15,000 bags of groceries, and nearly 200,000 articles of clothing. But you know what, San Diego, we can do it. Jenny Day is joining us live from Walter Porter, Porter Elementary School with how you can help. I have not said that correctly all morning <laughs> long. Walter Porter. <laughs> Jenny. You got it. Perfect, Heather. And I have some of those students here with me now. Say good morning, guys. Hi. Good morning. You are amazing, and they have excellent singing voices, too, and we're going to prove it to you in just a little bit. But I want to bring in Shanika here. You are a mother here. Yes. She's got four boys, and it's, it's tough for me to tell you this, but some kids, the only toy that they get this Christmas season will be the one that they get from Toys for Joy. So that just shows what the need is in our community, and you, for the first year, will get to benefit from this because times are a little tough for a lot of people. Yes, it is. Um, I'm a single parent with four children, so it's really kind of hard for me to get what all my kids want. So for Toys for Joy to step in, it really means a lot to me. And for you to be able to give your kids something new, there's also, they take clothing donations as well as food. What does that mean for you guys? It's life-changing. Yes, it just means really a lot, and I just really appreciate you guys coming in and stepping in for our community. Yeah, our community really does step up, and I want to bring in the principal of this amazing school. Tell me, this place is going to be just packed. December 12th is the day that you can come, no questions asked, and get something for a child in need. So true. Uh, this is our seventh year here at Porter uh, of the 19 years that this program has been going, and it is a great joy for the parents in this community. Uh, a lot of them, as you said, uh, just do not have or can't, as mom said, just can't get the things that their children want or need at this time of the year. And to be able to get a toy, clothing, and extra food to support during this time, it is a great, great thing to do. And talk to me. I want to bring in Greg now. Tell me what people, what would you, you encourage people to bring? I and mean, there's just really a mix. Right, absolutely. We're looking for over 23,000 toys. So any toys they want to come, or we're looking for volunteers, people that want to show up to help with this phenomenal event, and also gently, lightly use clothing as well for people that need um, clothing here during the holidays. And we'll throw the locations on our website. Thank you for being so brave and sharing Thank your you. story. All right, kids, I'm putting you to work. One, two, three. Brother and those reindeer. <laughs> Had a very shiny nose, and if you ever saw him, you wouldn't say it close. <laughs> Amazing! You guys are so wonderful. So again, if you can give back this holiday season, you guys are amazing. <laughs> Good job. Back to you. Ah, uh, thanks, Denny.